all right guys see we got us a long description here for the park uh created by star almighty this is the lakes and the description says welcome to my second park the lakes set around the lakes and rolling hills we have a park split into three sections the entrance and opening section is generically themed where you can ride some flat rides and experience the first custom fusion Hop on the Lake Express to be transported to the spooky area where you can enjoy the fiery theme Hail Drop. And the second custom coaster, Demon. With another ride on a train, you are then taken to the Wild West to experience the last two custom coasters. Eagle Lake is a soaring woody or over, oh, excuse me, a soaring woody over the lake and the 49ers. The mine train whipping you round the hills being only my second park i'm sure i can improve on a few things but overall i am really pleased with it highlights for me are the train stations for each area and the massive bavarian building with indoor fairground please download it stroll around and enjoy and that's definitely what we're gonna do here today mr Stoff almighty you know um what a long, long uh, intro there, but I'm definitely going to take a look at this because uh, Stoff is one of my subscribers that comments sometimes on videos and he suggested this park that he wanted me to look at. So I said I'll go ahead and take a look at it for him. You know, I, I'm, I'm doing such a bad job right here, man. I need to open up my secret Santa gift, you know, but yeah, let's get right into this park tour though, guys. All right, guys, we're here. We're here at the lakes park created by Stoff almighty you know um but one thing i want to say right off the bat Stoff, um go have you a lawsuit on your hands right here man what you trying to have a recreation of what happened in atlanta a couple of days ago with the guy guy crashed his car in front of a pro bass shop stripped naked and ran inside of their store and jumped into one of their aquariums in there yelling cannonball that's what's gonna happen right here man you know you know you're gonna go to jail too just like dude did but yeah here we go you know i like so far you know i like the whole lake aspect though you know when you come in you got the little bridge coming over you know over the over the over paths going over the lakes right to your entrance right here you know cool little touch cool little touch you know uh this is this creator's second park and also i checked their their workshop man they had two creations on there that i thought were really cool as well and another park you know so um but i like that they got the griffin house and the simpson house they have built on there i thought those was really cool you know um let me check those out in like a blueprint spotlight or something like that because i'm gonna start bringing those back to the channel as well you know and the first one of those i was going to do was cold sore omg you know he had a kid arama ride you know you probably saw it in the intro i got all those projects that i'm gonna be working on right there but let's get on to this one right here by Stoff Almighty. We come right on here. And you got like the Planet Coaster style builds right here. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Hey, this is the second uh, park too, man. We had somebody still in there. They own business. And you ain't catch it, though. He ain't gonna catch it, though. Oh, he chasing all the way out. Oh, man, Stoff, your security guard's relentless. My security guard's lazy. They stop at the gate. They turn around and get the wipe in their forehead like they've been running all day. Okay, let's check this out over here. What is this here? There's some kind of, uh, oh, this is an opening. I, man, I thought this was a wall. Duh. I thought this was a whole wall over here, man. This is a little food court area. Oh, yeah, this is nice, man. It looks pretty similar to something I was working on right now. In my cannabis farms, man. I can't wait till you guys see that, man. Ooh, we. You know, I'm showing out in that park. I'm showing out in that one. Uh, a lot of custom stuff. Yeah, a lot. You know what I'm saying? I'm showing my skills off a little bit. All right, but let's go over here. What is this over here? Like, see, I'm not going to lie to you, man. Like, I like this area, really, because, um, oh, let's say drive home safe. I'm like, what is that? And I, um, I like this area because one of my favorite colors is purple, though, on the low. You know, I like purple. You know, I, I wore that on my prom when I went to prom in high school. I had, you know, a nice little suit with a, a, a the purple accents and stuff all on it was dope it was dope and, um all right there we go this park man it looks little it looks small but it has 21 attractions in it but it's mostly flat rides and things like that and 
And we're here to ride these custom coasters that we heard about in the description. So we're going to go over here just to see what we got over here. You know, but what I can say for this being the second part, you know, you did a good use. You, excuse me. You did a good job of the usage of the, the foliage and the trees. You know what I mean? So, uh, the foliage, the trees, same thing, you know. You did good with the usage of that because uh, my first and second park, I don't think y'all even had near this amount of detail in my queue line as far as... This is actually cool, though. You see, I keep getting stoked because you got the squirting water coming out of the rocks right here. That, oh, oh, oh. That's something that you will see in a theme park. This is a nice queue line right here. And I'm not saying... Nowadays on Planet Coaster, you'll have creators saying that these is their first park, second park, and things like that, you know, but I see why he said that he liked the train station, so, yeah, this is amazing right here. This is definitely cool. Uh, how do you get in here, though? Oh, right there. I said, how do you get in here? We just walked through it. Get it together, Boogie. What is it going on today? All right, so here we go. Um want to get on the coaster here and that's the only thing you see that's missing you know but like i said he said it's his first ride but hold up is this the sign here okay what is this okay maybe this the 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 interest to the bumper cars here let me see let's see maybe this the interest to the bumper cars but like i say the the usage of all the trees and bushes and, and panels and rocks so far you know um, it's a good job, you know, for this being your second park or whatever, you know. But like I said, my second park, first and second, third park, look nothing like this either. You know what I mean? Uh, as far as, like, with all the trees and things. Like, I don't think I even had any trees in my first and second park, honestly. So, okay, here we go. I think this is a coaster right here, Fusion. All right. See, this is always cool, too, when people change the color of the uniforms or the gate the gate ticket agents and stuff that's always a nice touch and then you got the queue cover in here yeah man see that's what i'm saying man you know i, I can't wait y'all see cannabis farms man I, I did a whole lot of things like these you know what i'm saying like a lot of stuff like this type of stuff you know went custom with a lot of things man showing off but let's go i noticed man Ain't no priority in this line man you know i, I like priority in my passes man priority pass lines man that's all right, man. You know what I'm saying? Same my park, you know what I'm saying? I'm just visiting. I'm visiting. Yeah, it's all good. But here we go, man. We got like one of them little wild mouse things, but it ain't no wild mouse. I forgot what they call this thing, you know. It's a, a bird chest. <laughs> but we're going to ride this thing. It's called Fusion. Cost $10 to get on this thing. It ain't green across the boards, but um, we're going to get on it in, uh, let me see. We'll see C2 or 3. 2. It'll be 2 because it make it like it's sitting in the middle. So, it looks like we're going to have to wait a minute. So, I'll talk to y'all when the ride get on. Let's wait. See, when these lift chains be going up so slow like this, that's what terrified me the most on coasters. I'm not going to even lie to you. Just get me right to the point, man. Ooh, wait. not a bad ride that wasn't a bad ride at all but you know let me let me let me share a little secret with you guys man There's something about little scott boogie you know um <clears throat> one thing i don't like i don't like dive coasters really you know what i'm saying you know I, I try to act tough you know but i do not like dive coasters man i don't like the aspect of you know you creep me up there and then you hang me like that looking over the uh, edge of the tracks and then drop me down like that 
it's just something about that feeling in my stomach on the dive coaster. You know, I like to get straight to the point. Just go on, take me up to the top of the top hat and go on, drop me down. You know what I'm saying? But, you know. Hey, it is what it is. You know, okay, look at the pathways here. They go, got a little overpass for the train here. Man, that's crazy, though. Everybody walking across this uh, overpass gonna get hit with all that smoke, though. But that's real life, though. That's realistic, though. All right, so, no, nah, we don't want to go this. I think we want to... Do we want to go that way or do we need to go this way? Because you got to go across a lot of bridges, it looks like, or take the train in this park to get to the other side because of the water. You know, which is a cool little feat, a cool little uh, touch to this park. So uh, let's go around this way. That's crazy, man, that I'm looking at this purple and green like this because, like, you know, this is reminding me of my cannabis farm, of the area I'm working on. One of the bushes is this color, green and green and purple. Yeah, it's funny though. All right, we got the look like that's a nice little rock fountain right now. The Vista Point there, take some pictures. All right, so that's the exit to the train, right? Yeah. So over, oh, we got a tunnel right here. We got us uh, some bathroom. We got the what it is, the uh, Victorian bathrooms. I think these are. All right. I go. I think that's, think that's a workshop item, but it's still cool. Like to me, I don't, I don't, I don't buy. It don't matter to me about the you using workshop items and stuff like that. You know, it's just how you use them to me. You know, that's how I, you know, I, I view this stuff. Like I use workshop items, like the end game workshop items, but I tear them down. You know, I ain't gonna lie to you. I tear them up and and. Use them for something else and fix it up to be something else, man. Like I said, man, y'all will see when y'all see cannabis farms, you know. But a lot of that stuff was custom, though, you know. But some of it was uh, a couple of in-game blueprints that I gutted out and flipped around and turned into something else. I like how this cave is looking. I'm too busy looking at the, the way the roofing is from the... But I was like, how did he get it to be like that? But then I just thought about it. When you put the walls up there, they get that effect. So, yeah, duh. All right, so let's go through this tunnel here, man. Let's go through our tunnel here. You know, this is a park called The Lakes, created by Stoff Almighty, guys. You know, this is this creator's second park. So, you know, I'm just going through. I'm going to give a little feedback when I can, you know. Have a little fun in the park right here. Uh-oh, we're in the spooky area, it looks like. Alright, now uh, this is the spooky area. Mm-hmm. Alright, so like it was something over here I wanted to see. Because from the description, okay, it's a hilltop hotel. Hmm. Where is that at? That's a nice sign though though. That's a nice sign in the way you made that. With the uh, the pillars and the this the sign. Wait, the hotel is up here or something? Oh, wait a minute now. Don't tell me the hotel way up here. Alright, let's take this out, man. This is this is a cool little park right here, man. Like I'm having a little fun in here. You know, just walking around, just trying to discover things. You know? Hmm. Alright. It's basically like my first full park tour of twenty twenty four here. Oh yeah, this is the hotel up here. This is cool. This is real cool. This is cool. Now, see, the thing about it is, like, now the difference the difference with with me now, or what I do now, like, this would have been cool if I would have thought of something like this. Like, over here, I would have had a seating area, though. Like, I would have had, like, a little, uh, I would I wouldn't have had some of these trees. These trees probably wouldn't have been right here. This probably would have been, like, a little seating area for outside, uh, you know what I'm saying, for the, the guests of the hotel. But, yeah. It's just cool. That's a cool touch right here. This is nice. This is nice. All right, so let's get back down on the path and go back down. You know, and like I said, this is second park, and the fact that you use and touch is like putting the walls on the side of the, you know, the the path thing when you make a staircase is, you know, a lot of creators don't know that when they first start playing the game. So that means you've been watching a lot of videos of, of Planet Coaster, you know what I'm saying, watching it other channels and watching people play this game you know see that's how you can tell a little bit too now that's a nice view of that coaster right here too 
you need a vista i said i was gonna say a vista you need a vista point right here so people could take a nice little shots right here because that's a nice shot of that coaster right there it'd be nice if we can get a view of it coming through right now dang that looked a little bit fast though yeah, we're going to have to check that out, man. We got to check that ride out, man. That looked a little bit fast right there. But the folks was loving it. They were screaming on it. Okay. All right, that's got to be this ride. It's a demon. Oh, it's got to be this. That's got to be this ride. All right, so let's go check that out. I like all the dead trees in the park, too, man. I love that, you know. 6'9". Look at them in the park with us. A couple of 6'9s up in here. All right, let's go on there. We got to cut the line, you know, because we don't got no priority passes in here. And, oh, my God, this line is massive. I thought this was a Stacy coming up. Oh, this guy, look at this guy. Like, you see what I'm saying? Like, this is a, a second part, but you, you went to the level of detail of making a graveyard, you know, a grave digger and all of that and the grave sites over here, the church. This is cool, man. Oh, and it's a boomerang coaster? Yeah, that thing got to go fast, man. That, I, was like, I got to check this thing out. That thing looked like it whipped past that little inversion kind of fast, though. Let's check it out, though. Let's check it out, you know. You know, I ain't no coaster expert, man, but, you know, I, be, I done got a lot better at making my coasters and smoothing out my coasters, my coaster stations, you know. It's been a process for me, been a process, but uh, I've been having fun. So, all right, let's come up in here. Got a little bit of beam work up here. With the uh, chandeliers, with the candles. I always wonder, with those type of chandeliers, right? Maybe it's just me. Rich or no rich, you know, rich or not rich, I'm sorry. Who gets up there and lights those things every night? Or they just stay burning because you know you got to change those candles after a while so who does that yeah i always wondered that but uh we're gonna wait till this ride come back you know because it seems like it's whizzing through the tracks here we're gonna take it let's first let's see what the stats is on this thing all right nope i knew they were gonna make me click the wall all right let's get the stats on this thing it's not green across the board but it got a 7.60 excitement though man Okay, the speed is negative, so it must be going backwards, coming backwards or something. All right, so we're going to see. Let me see. Hold up. It's 12 inversions on this ride. God. Wee! This is going to be a fun ride here. It's 12 inversions on here. The max G force is negative one. Vertical G's. See, look, yeah, that's, that's kind of high. The max, yeah, that seems like that's kind of high. All right, so we're going we gonna to see, though. We're going to see. We're going to get on this thing right now. This is the demon. We're going to get on this. Um, yeah, we definitely just going to sit right here, and we're going to wait for this to get started. And I'm going to get my feedback when we get off. The height on this thing is crazy. Yeah, this thing should be fast.
don't know. You know, it, it's fast, but it seems like it's fast enough. That ride was that ride was uh it was pretty on the fast side you know uh, but for having 12 inversions and the the way that the let's go out here uh, the the type of inversions and the way the inversions are and how they are you know it, it needed enough speed to complete this circuit that you made that he laid out here so I think if you would have had it going at a, a normal boomerang speed I don't think uh, it would have made it through all these inversions especially like this one way over here like that big wide one right there that would have slowed it down for number one and then it wouldn't have made it through this one over here you know like even though it's coming this way going that way but yeah it was a cool little ride overall so i'm gonna get off for of that and that was the demon right that was the demon uh, hey wait 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 how we get off the thing oh this over here there was the demon but, uh, okay, yeah, it was a little bit on the fast side, but it was still a cool ride overall. Um, but I, I think the speed is for getting through the inversions and things like that. But, you know, the guests like it. The guests like it, and somebody didn't tow up two garbage cans over here. You know, you know, I don't like stuff like that. I don't play about stuff like that in my park, man. I be going crazy. You know what I'm saying? I be throwing them out. All right, we, okay, this is the way we came in. Did we, meet, did we see everything in this side here? Yeah. He says three sections, so I didn't see any like food areas or nothing over here. No. Hey, but I ain't gonna lie, I like how when you go through there, it light up though. That's cool, man. I like that. And what that is, the crematorium? Oh, see, that, that, that just even made the ride even better for me right there. That's a cool touch. Okay, here, I'm gonna say, here go the food court and everything over here. This is nice. Oh, the little scary pumpkin right there. All right, all right. The ATMs, the toilets. Mm-hmm. And what we got there? Oh, hell drop. That's what I wanted to see. Okay, hell drop. Oh wow. Yep, see. Yep. That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm starting to wonder. You know. I uh I don't know. I was gonna say, man, I want to know, I, I got to look back and see, like, when he uploaded this park on the thing. Because I'm like, man, this look like a little inspiration here, man, you know what I'm saying? You know, I got a park tour coming up for the uh, uh, Pharaoh's Yard, you know, one of my uh, parks from last year that I've been holding on to so I can have some new content, some new parks that I did with some of my new style and everything. And I did something similar to this. But it's, it's in the gold cave, you know, with a lot of gold in the walls and things like that. But like I said, you guys will see it. But this the hell drop, though. You know, I'm a, I'm, I usually don't take a ride on these, but I'm going to take a ride on this one when it's, when it's made like this, you know. And we're going to see what it look like, see what kind of views we get when we get up off of this. Um, it shouldn't be too much, but we're going to see right now, though. We're going to check it out. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. side of the park do look kind of spooky with all the dead trees now we was under the ground and this thing came out the ground and it's still tall crazy
All right, all right. That was the hell drop. You know what I'm saying? We going off the hell drop. That was cool, a little cool. Like I said, that thing was buried in the ground right here. And even when it went up to the top of the spire there, it still was tall over the park. You know. But I'm not gonna lie, man, you know. I use those rides in my park, you know, but that's that's the only only time I'm a fan of those rides now, man. Um I'm definitely not a fan of drop towers anymore, ever since that little that young man lost his life on that ride in, in Florida it was. That giant drop ride. Which I felt like that was the park's fault, you know, for letting that kid ride that ride when he was too big. But, you know, either way it go, that's that was a sad situation. And from that day on, I was no longer a fan of drop towers like that. I use them on Planet Coaster, though. You know, I ride them on here, but real life, you will not see me riding one. All right, what is this? The Lake Express, right? This is a train? And it's a train station? All right. I, 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 I didn't want to uh, get on the train, but, you know, let's go up here and see. You know, it's a lot of folks want to get on the train, so uh, I guess we'll get on the train then. All right, let's go around here, though. It's a cool little park, though, stuff. You know, um, so this is your second park or whatever. I could tell that you uh, took your time with it, though. You, uh, you wanted to be creative. You added uh, certain details and effects that you wanted in the park, which is is always a nice touch, man. And I don't think too many new creators or second park or people who make the second park, first park, doing things like that. So, and like I said, the the Griffin and Simpson house that I seen on your workshop, you know, that's that's creative, you know. So you can, you can build. I can see you can build on here. Uh, you can. You got some potential to do some cool things, you know. Uh, so far, like I said, I have no problems with the park right now. It's a cool little park. Oh, we got us a train coming in. I hope this the one we want to get on. Let me see. Let's see if this the one we want to get on. Is it? I think it is. I think it is. Is it? We didn't pick nobody up, huh? Oh, this train must be full. All right, so we out. Well, yeah, let's do orbit so we can move around and see the views. So we gotta take the train. I like say we had to take the train over here to the, the western side. So we're gonna take the train over here to the western side. Uh oh. Like I said, this park got 21 attractions, but it's mostly flat rides and a couple of coasters. You know, so we're just gonna walk around and view the park and get on the, the coasters. We got a steampunk ride over there, the light. All right. We just rolling through the wall here. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. Well, we just end up over there. That was nice right there. Is that it here? Where we just getting up off that train at? Oh, right here? Oh, yeah. Here we go. This is where we got off that train at. Oh, yeah. This is nice right here. This is a nice station. I, yeah, your station, your train stations are cool. The train stations are cool. I give you that right there. You got your horse stalls right there for the horses. All right, then you come out, and then here we go over the bridge to a massive coaster right there. All right, so let's go down here. Uh oh, we want it. You got wanted posters over here. We're in the saloon. Now we're in the Wild West, guys. All right, it's the railway station. Okay, that's the name of that train station. All right, see, so yeah, here go that, that storefront I used in, that, in my Western world. But I made it cut, made it functional with a lot of... And you made this one functional because you made this the entrance to a ride here, Eagles Lake. Is that a flat ride? Eagles Lake? I say, are you yellow? Are you yellow? I don't know. Are you yellow? 
Hmm. All right. Yeah, we got our queue line over here. Okay, yeah, this look like the coaster, so we're going to go in and get on this coaster real quick. Go ahead, guys. Let's go on around and get on the coaster. You know, like I said, this is simple and plain uh, to the point, but uh, I would have had some railing on this path, though. Like, when you got guests going up into the station, at least would have had some rails on this path. Yeah. Got like, even if it's just a game on here, you know, you got to think about certain parts of the realism or the aspect of a park, like, you know, what would really be realistic. You wouldn't see that in the park, right, that uh, uh, entrance to a ride with no rails on the on the steps, you know. It's just stuff like that, little, little nitpick stuff like that, nothing, nothing major, though. But uh, I didn't even get the name of this. Oh, okay, I did. This is Eagles Lake. And like it's all green across the board as well, guys. So we're gonna take a ride on Eagles Lake and uh we're gonna finish this tour when we get off. at the end you know but uh overall the the ride was fairly smooth for a, a wooden coaster you know you know how i feel about wooden coasters man they bang me up you know they bang me up but i enjoyed that coaster right there the views of the lake you know it was nice it was nice let me see and, and you got a lot of percentage left in this park you know you can go back and put you like some little decorations in that that lake back there let me see like back here I put some decorations in this lake, man. A couple of boats or something like that, man. Maybe make a, a pier or something somewhere out there. That'd be cool. It'd be cool. All right, but uh, oh, okay. Let's go this way because this is that's another thing right here that he said he was proud of in this park. The big Bavarian building right here with the fairgrounds inside. So let's go check this out. Yeah, this does look massive right here. This is very nice. So I ain't gonna lie, I do like this build style as well you know as far as the building pieces that you use they, they versatile for me because i could use them in various ways multiple ways for other different things so yeah i enjoy those all right let's check this thing out in here oh oh yeah this is really cool flat uh, flat rise galore up in here so this is where majority of the flat rides are huh you know what, to this day of Planet Coaster, I have yet to use one of these rides in my park. And I done did a bunch of them so far, so, you know. And even with the way I build now, I still haven't used one of those. I didn't use one of these before I didn't use one of those. I didn't even use one of these. <laughs> I've never used one of these before. But yeah, this is cool as well. And like I said, for a second build, a uh, second park, you know, yeah. I could tell, like I said, I could tell you took your time with this one, and you was, uh, I didn't check out the other park I seen on your workshop, I may check that out after this part to go download that one as well, and take a look at it and see, see, like, uh, the progression, and, uh, from that park to this park, or which park, is, you know, you put more time in, or I could tell you put more time in, or whatever, but, uh, yeah, let's see what's around here, nothing. Oh, and more Bavarian building. What's this over here? More shops. Oh, now this is cool. Now I like, see up in here a couple of tables and it would have been cool. Oh, I like the little, the little seals on the um 
the ceiling right there on the wall. That's cool. Yeah, he did a good job with this, man. I like this. And then you come out and you get a nice view of the little genie carpet ride right here. Oh, okay. Like, you should add, like, like I said, you got a lot of percentage, it seems like, in this part. So you should go back and uh, add some ride signs to some of your flat rides. Especially, like, when you just got a... Especially when you just got, like, an entrance just there like that. You know, even though it's a ride here and everybody knows that it's for this ride, you know... It may not be for this ride. Like, it could have been a queue line to start for that wooden coaster way back there, you know. So, like, putting the name on the rides, like, that's just something I do a lot now, you know. I put on all the rides. I got a, a sign on it, you know. So. Oh, look at that over there, the Fords. Okay, I ain't see that. Let's go take a look at that. How you get over there? All right, we got to go back. Oh, that's a dead end. How you get over there to that thing? Look at that. That's nice right here. Now, this is really nice. Now, this is a, a, a nice ride sign here. You got the lava flowing from it. You got the rocks at the bottom right there. And then at the top, you got the... Yeah, this this that's, that's cool right here. Let's go see what it look like inside the queue line. Oh, man. Saw blades all on the wall. You got the oven over here. It's cooking. That's crazy, man. That look just like those little things. They be uh, forging like they be making the swords and the knives and stuff on like that show. Or was it forged in fire or something like that? That show is cool, man. They be giving them people piles of crap. Scrap metal and they be making katana swords and stuff out of that stuff. Axes and stuff. It's a cool show. Alright, yeah, this is cool right here. That's the forge. Mm, Alright, I like that. Nice that. All right, let's go over here and get on off, though. You know, we ain't going to get on that. Just wanted to see what it looked like inside there. And yeah, let's go back to our back here. Oh, man. So we got on the Demon, the Fusion. It was Demon, Fusion, Eagles Lake. And I it wanted another coaster. I think it was another. Oh, the Mine Train. We got to go back toward the western area. It was a, the mine train coaster. It's a mine train coaster in here somewhere. We got to go back, guys. I don't want to forget a coaster. No coaster left behind, guys. And then get this hood off the screen, too. All right, here we go. All right, so it's a mine train around here somewhere. We got on. It's got to be back there on that hill, so... I guess we didn't go back far enough when we was in the western area. Oh, that bathroom stink right there. Ain't nobody gonna use that one. Ooh wee. Ain't nobody gonna use that bathroom. Yo, oh, guess happiness gonna go down. Oh, and there's a lot of people trying to use the bathroom. Oh, hold up. Let me help you out, man. Let me help you out, man. Go on in there and take care of that, man. People trying to use the bathroom up in here. See, look, he, look, he's like, oh, man, really? Man, that's some stanky bathroom, man. It got green smoke coming up out of there. Ooh-wee. All right, so here we go. Ladder shop, so we'll go over here. All right, what this is? Uh, steamer factory, under construction, works available. Trespassers will be, damn, hung or shot. <laughs> damn, do we want to get on this rack? Do we want to get on? They might think we trespassing. You know, they got the pieces of the ceiling in here. Now, this is cool, though. This is nice, though. And this for that uh, ride over here, though, right? Yeah, this for that uh, ride here. All right. That's for that ride there. Uh -oh. The way you got these, some of these flat rides and decorated around them is very cool, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't even want to say... Yeah, a new builder or nothing like that, you know. I, I, I just want to say, like, for a second park, you know, you know this is really cool. Because, like, I don't even have my first and second and third parks anymore. I don't even think, um, I think overseers, you can look at them. I don't even think I have my first, second, or third parks anymore. All right, because I started deleting them when I started getting better at building parks if I didn't 
recreate the parks. You know what I'm saying? So, all right, man. This is okay. The food barn. This is nice. This is definitely nice. I like the entrance way to this. This is really cool. That's a nice way to use these, these roofing pieces here as well, though. I, th I think that's what I like about this. It looks real Western in here. 6 9 up in here. It's autographed, 6 9 Alright. Yeah, this is nice. It's a nice setup in here. You got the watermelons over there, the melons, the drinks over here. Yeah, this is nice. This is really nice. Now, where's that mine train at, though? It's gotta be it over here. Oh, it's gotta be it right here. It's gotta be it right here. Yeah, say mine, something up there on that thing, man. I ain't got my glasses on, I ain't got my glasses. You know what I'm saying? My eyes be going bad on me, man. You know what I'm saying? All right, here we go. We got an entrance to something right here. Like, this whole architecture is nice right here. And this is all just for a train station for the ride, man. Like I said, this is real cool. And I wasn't thinking like this at, at my second park. You know, I was making carnivals. I'm not going to lie to you. I was literally making carnivals. You know, compared to what I could make now on Planet Coaster and the stuff that I'd be doing tours of, I was making carnivals. All right, so here we go. I bet this look real nice at night with all these oil lamps out here. We definitely gonna get a nighttime side of this park, so don't worry, don't worry. All right, I'm just enjoying myself walking around in here. Uh, we in the Lakes Park, created by Stoff Almighty. Yeah, all right, let's go up in here. Mind the gap. What gap? See, everybody had to use the bathroom because they had to walk past that stanky bathroom on the way to the ride over here. They say, what did they say over here? Live munition. He said, live munition, but y'all got a uh, candle by the dynamite. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's crazy. All right, so we got us a mine train right here. This is the last and final coaster in this park, I think. You know, we're going to do an overhead shot before we end the tour anyway to make sure we didn't miss any coasters in here. All right. Oh, we got all green across the board right here. That's always a plus on the mine train. So we're going to get on this thing, and this is called the 49er. So we're going to get on the 49er, but we got to get in the Pacific seat on the 49er because the mine trains, you know, we always got to sit in the back on these because sitting in the front, you can't see nothing because of the train car in the front. So sitting in the front of these is a horrible seat. So we're going to sit back here in the back seat of the 49ers where they got us back here with this live ammunition with candles in it and uh we're gonna com com complete the tour and finish off our tour here at the lakes when we get back guys enjoy the ride One thing I can say before we get started, I do like when people take the time to detail their mind train rides because they give it even more of an effect when you're riding it. So, yeah, enjoy the ride, guys. far my favorite ride of the park that was my favorite coaster in the park right there like just all of the layout man this was man this was cool right here i could ride this all day long i definitely could ride this all day long no no we got let's, let's get a nighttime shot of this park right here let's see what this is like at night and it's absolutely fantastic so much so like we got a little lighting on the course 
Yeah, certain spots, certain spots. A little bit of light in certain areas. Yeah, this was a cool mine train ride. I think this, out of all the park tours I've done and the mine trains I've I've rode, that was, this was one of my favorite ones. Outside of, I think I did another one that was like the recreation of the mine train in Disneyland. That one was that was also a, a good one. Now this one is up there with some of my top mine train rides that on the road on Planet Coaster, man. The layout was was fun, man. It's like over the mountain, over the hills, around the hills, around the trees, through the rocks, through the caves, over the water. You know, it was cool, man. Like, I like that. And then let's just get the nighttime shot of the park, period, over here. This whole western area, it looks fantastic. You know, all the warm lighting in here, the colorful lighting on the wooden coaster there. Like, yeah, let's go over here. Let's see. Like, so the park is literally, as you can see, the layout of it is basically built around the the lake, you know, basically. I guess hence the name, the lake. But yeah, this was a cool park stop. I enjoyed this. Uh, thanks for telling me to come check out your park. Um, if you got anything else you would like me to check out, man, you know how to do it. You know, just hit me up, let me know, and I'll come and take a look at it, put it on my schedules. You know, but yeah, this is a cool little park, cool little concept here. We got three different areas in here. We got 21 rides. Uh, I think it's four coasters. Four coasters, I think. Yeah, four coasters in this park, you know. But overall, man, it's a, it was a fun time in here. And uh, yeah, I enjoyed this. So this part tour today was brought to you by Starf Almighty. And this was called The Lakes. You can go check it out on the workshop, guys, if you like. Um, or if you have any feedback that you could uh, leave this creator, feel free to drop it down in the comment section below. And be out on the be on the lookout. Oh my goodness, be on the lookout for my next video. Uh, it's another update video from my cannabis farms, man. It's something that I'm working on. You know, I was thinking about dropping that park on 420, but I changed my mind, so I'm going to move the date up, and I'll probably just do another tour of the park or do a live stream of the, in the park on 420. But, yeah. But this has been the, the Lakes Park, created by Staff Almighty on the Frontier Workshop, guys. Go ahead and check it out if you like. Well, like I said leave any feedback or comments down in the comment section below so until next time guys don't forget if you're new to the channel smash that like button that subscribe button as well and i'll catch you guys in the next park tour video